In the past, numerous other candidates for president have used many of the same processes to pursue their own election challenges. As recently as 2016, the Clinton campaign brought multiple post-election court cases, demanded recounts, and ridiculously declared the election stolen by Russia. Many Democrats even attempted to persuade the Electoral College delegates to overturn the 2016 results. House Manager Raskin objected to the certification of President Trump's victory four years ago, along with many of his colleagues. You'll remember it was Joe Biden who had to gavel them down. I have an objection because 10 of the 29 electoral votes cast by Florida were cast by electors not lawfully certified. I object to the votes from the state of Wisconsin, which were not, should not be legally no certified. No debate. Or Mr. President, I object to the certificate from the state of Georgia on the grounds that the electoral votes no, were no not. No debate. There's no debate. And I object to the certificate uh, from the state of North Carolina. I object to the 15 votes from the state of North Carolina. Um, I object. I object to the certificate from the state of Alabama. The electors were not lawfully certified. Is it signed by a senator? Not as of yet, Mr. President. In that case, the objection cannot be entertained. The objection cannot be entertained. The Counting debate is not in order. Ballot. Even with the mail there is no debate in order. Is it signed by a senator? There is no debate. There is no debate in the joint session. There is no debate. There is no debate. There is no debate. And the mass Please come to order. The objection cannot be received. But the Russian Section 18, Title III of the United States Code prohibits debate in the joint session. I do not wish to debate. I wish to ask, is there one United States senator who will join me in this letter? There is no debate. There is no debate. The gentlewoman will suspend.